welcome to Research Bites, your daily dose of science news. On entering a zoo or forested area, the most common animal to be encountered is a deer or its close relative. This gives us the impression that deer populations are plentiful all over the world. But with increasing deforestation and poaching, they are declining as well. The Indian hog deer is an endangered species protected by the Indian Wildlife Act of 1972. These small deer are scientifically named Axis porcinus and are found in many parts of Asia. In a recent study published in the journal Scientific Reports, researchers discovered a new subspecies of hog deer in Northeast India, which was earlier thought to have been found only in Southeast Asia. There are two previously known subspecies of hog deer, the western race that is found in parts of Pakistan and along the Terai grasslands along the Himalayan foothills stretching up to Nepal and Myanmar. The other subspecies, the eastern race, are found in parts of Thailand, Indochina, Laos, Cambodia and Vietnam. As the eastern race has a bleak distribution, its range in India is not well known. This study reported the discovery of the eastern race subspecies Axis porcinus anamiticus from the Kebul Lamjao National Park in Manipur. This discovery shows that the western range of the hog deer belonging to the eastern race stretches until Manipur and north central Thailand as previously thought. The researchers collected shedded antlers, fecal matter, and dead remains of the hog deer from different locations in India. Based on the genetic data, the researchers divided the populations of hog deer into two groups. Those samples collected from Manipur belong to the first group, while the rest form the other group. By comparing the genetic features between the two, the researchers concluded that the small population from Manipur was Axis porcinus anamiticus, the eastern hog deer. The findings of the study show that the small hog deer population in Manipur of around 100 individuals has a low genetic diversity and is prone to extinction. The researchers also believe that the eastern subspecies, which has already lost its habitat in other countries, needs to be conserved for its evolutionary and ecological significance. There is a need to establish a captive breeding centre for hog deer populations in India where selected and genetically distinct individual adult hog deers can be used to produce genetically diverse offspring. Thank you for listening. Don't forget to like, share and follow. This podcast was brought to you by Research Matters, a SciComm initiative by Gupi Labs. For more science-based stories, podcasts and news, log on to our website www.researchmatters.in